in this uh, behemoth hunting I'm going to show you spots that I have found bohemus and I will show you spots where the bohemus respawn on a regular basis and we'll start out with this of course is where you find swan I'm sure everybody knows about swan those who don't this is where you find him He's right here in the water when you first encounter him He is not respawn. He does not respawn. So once he's gone, he's gone. And as you can see, he's like between Good Neighbor and uh, Diamond City. And again, he does not respawn. But this is one spot for a Bohemoth. is uh, in Lexington which is south of Starlight Drive-In um, right here around Super Duper Mart Corvega there's also another behemoth um, I killed him already um, I haven't seen him respawn yet doesn't mean he don't I just haven't noticed it yet. here at this spot is where we find the so-called Stonehenge of cars. Um, there's also a behemoth there. Um, I did already kill him. We can just head south past the do not feed the bear sign. Right below the bridge. There it is. It does not look like this when you first encounter this area. Um, the vehicles actually, you know, have paint and stuff on them. They have color. But unfortunately, the cars got destroyed. So I don't know if, if you don't destroy the cars, if you'll keep respawning or not. But there's a behemoth here also. And here's where he's at, like I said, south of Walden Pond. There's also a, a suitcase and a toolbox in the center with random items. So, like I said, he does not respawn here. But like I said, I destroyed the car, so, you know, maybe he does. I don't know. But this right here is my most popular spot. I love this place. This, this behemoth does respawn. Um, not only do you have a behemoth, but you usually have three to four death claws. Um, I've had glowing, I've had legendary, I've had all, all kinds. It depends on, on, it's different every time I come here. And again, you know, I guess their levels is going to depend on your levels and your settings as far as your difficulty. But right down here is an old power plant, I guess, that, or switching station. It's not on the map. I love this spot. I love coming here. I gotta be careful because uh, usually they're right here behind this. When you first encounter the death claws, they're right here behind this house. But we'll see. Oh. Okay. Oh shit, dude. Sorry, man. K9 friend, sorry. Just keep heading west up here. Up, oh, my first death claw. Yes. I'm gonna let Grim, he's my robot. I'm gonna let him. I'll draw the thing towards me, but I'm gonna let my robot do most of the work on this one. Back here. Get him, Grim. Get Grim. Here. Get him, man. Get him, man. Oops. Oh. Second missile was a mistake. I call it my trigger finger, or whatever you want to call it. My right index finger it tends to keep wanting to press the trigger when I don't want to. It's like a reflex, just like it's constantly flicking. 
Okay, so that's one death claw. Okay, now I'm heading in the front side of this place that we're heading to. Um, you come in from the back and there's a an old billboard over there somewhere on the hill. But usually there's a couple of rad scorpions over there also. But I'm going to come in the front way this time. And like I said, these respawn. I mean, come back every couple of days, game time. I'm not sure the exact time. Don't, don't quote me on two days. It's somewhere between, I don't know, I'm going to say two and five. Somewhere around there, maybe. But anyway, they respawn. And you never know what you're going to get. I've had legendary behemoths. I've had glowing behemoths. Uh, there's one. Oh, he's regular. Okay. I like using my Fat Man only because I love the sound of the explosion. I like the way it looks. The sound to these headphones is just freaking awesome. Now, see, if I wouldn't kill him, he must be after something because he was running. Because he'll fight Death Falls if they're in there. Boom. See ya. Oh, no. You're up, Graham. Do your thing. And again, you know, I'm level 80 this time, so... It's going to depend on your levels. But, you know, you never know what you're going to get off of them. I just like the... Uh, it's just fun. I love coming here. I love this spot. All right, so we got our behemoth. We got one death claw. So we got uh, two or three more death claws at least. You usually get three to four. Usually four. Huh. Oh, there's a death claw. Pop it, do you, man? You man, pop it, do you, man? All right, that's two. One time I came here and there was a, a glowing legendary inside this one barn up here, I'll show you. He was right inside that barn up there. Like he was trying to get out the back side of it, it was weird. So we bought two more at least. At least two more. Oh, an alpha. Not getting? Yeah. Sensor alert. Possible hostile in area. Nope. I shot Grim. He's anxious, man. That Grim, man, he loves to kill. Do it, dude. Get him. I'm death called a beautiful animal. I can't wait till we can trap him. The next DLC, man. Be able to trap animals. Yeah. Alright. That's one, two, that's three. So we still got another one. Usually he's back here behind the building. Back here. So you're going to hear me clicking on my bat thing. Up. Oh, uh, nope. Nothing here. Wow, oh, okay. So maybe it's just three this time. We'll see. Fuck it. Yeah, man. Look at that. There's nothing in these buildings. There, there's shells. There's no boxes. No nothing. I mean, there's nothing you can loot from in the buildings at all. I'll show you around. Whoa, wait now. I hear something. What is that? Ah, death claw number four. Hi, man. Come here, man. Where you going? There he goes. Bat. Time to hit back. Yeah, man. Duke. Oh, man, look. He ducked his head behind the door. Epic fail on that shooting. So he's a regular also. Oh, well. But like I said, they do respawn here. So, you know, if you want to be a you know, farmer. I think this building's just for protection from those animals. Oh, 
There's nothing to get <laughs> except these animals. You'd be a good spot so you know find them. And again, here's where I'm up. I'll show you there's nothing in here either. Anyway, that's this is my favorite spot. I just figured I'd show you. But like I said, they respawn here every so many days. I'm not going to be specific because I'm not sure. All I know is that it seems like every time I come here, they're here. And this is where it's at. It's easy to find. It's not too far from uh, the Stonehenge, actually, when you think about it. my favorite spot and then this is our final spot that I'm going to show you now but it's a respawnable I mean he's constantly here too again you never know what you're getting off of and this spot is just north of Murkwater construction and our place to he's usually by himself there's nobody else around with him. There's no death claws or anything. I think one time I did fight some murlocs, but I think it's the way I came in to get him. I drew the murlocs, but right here at this school, there's some ferals. Let's see if he's over here. Uh huh. There he is. Bohemus. Oh, oh, cool. An epic. Yes, they're ready. Break out the big goons. I'll break them out! Break them out, man! Break out the big guns! Four percent jump. Slow Four percent chance of hitting. Epic fail. Damn. Try again. really wasted uh, again I love that sound come on man come on man you dead you dead man oh what is that freaking brotherhood it is oh oh I got one missile on the board oh shit Oh, you had to see this ugliness, but um, it's hard to edit. There he goes! The kamikaze died. Also, over here by this behemoth, um, he's usually right around a steamer trunk. I'll show you. It's a random items also every time. But hey, I love it. Again, right here. Again, right here. On the map. Just a little bit northwest of Suffolk. And like I said, he respawns also. And here's the steamer chest. Random stuff. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Good luck killing these suckers. I love them. I like killing them. Hey, y'all, dudes, do that, boys and girls. Enjoy, man.